It is your choices that define who you are. My choice is you, Michaela. I choose to do life with you, to adult with you, to be happy with you, to be sad with you, to be healthy with you, to be sick with you. I vow to surrender every minute the Lord gives me to this pursuit of your happiness. You will never be lonely alone. My love will always linger. I will be faithful to you in both mind and body. Baby, it's settled. I promise it's settled. You're all I want. You make me smile, you make me laugh, and most importantly, you make me feel loved. Ryan, I won't let go at any price, and I need you now like I needed you then, all those summers ago. Ryan, you feel like home to me, you make me feel safe, and I promise to always be there for you to be a home for you. Well, some of you may be asking what such a young, dapper man such as myself is standing up here. <laughs> but I'm real thankful for the opportunity because this is my grandson. And his mother is my daughter. And uh, it's a happy day for me, also. Where the Bible speaks to us about the way that we're to live our life and relate to one another. And I quote the scripture, walk in a manner with all humility and gentleness and patience. Bearing with one another in love, eager to maintain the unity of the spirit in the bond of peace. God, thank you so much for today. God, we're thankful for this couple. We're thankful for the picture of Christ that they present to others that are around them through their, their joy and their love for each other. For as much as you, Kayla and Ryan, have come together before God and these witnesses, and you've pledged your love and your life to one another, you declare so by giving and receiving of rings, looking to heaven for divine sanction, and according to the laws of the state of South Carolina, I pronounce you husband and wife. May your oneness never separate. You may kiss your bride. <laughs>
I want to remind you not to fear for tomorrow. Enjoy the moments of today. Put the one who shows us all perfect love first in your relationship and know that not only God loves you, but I love y'all both so much and I'm so happy for y'all. Thank you, Ryan, for being one of my best friends and for being a true friend uh, in every stage of life. Michaela, thank you so much for being the person that makes Ryan happy. Thank you so much for being the person that has in a way completed him and made him who he is and who he's supposed to be. I've always told Michaela that I will and I have always and I will be her number one fan. In um, sports and in life. So tonight I have one more to cheer for. It's you, brother. We'll be right back.